Hey everyone, I'm Alfred. Welcome back to another episode of Deep Rock Galactic. Deposit your quota of Morkite into the mule. We'll send a drop pod to get you out. Good luck. Now, this is out and away far, far more than I could really expect for... Just... You know, this is not a roguelike. This is so not a roguelike. And I knew that when I started, but... Man, I'm having so much fun, I want to record more. And you know what? Fuck you. This is my show. So hey, Deep Rock Galactic it is. Um, really, really enjoy... Th this is the thing that I feel like all games have a problem with sometimes. And really, it can depend on the game. But sometimes you just have an issue where you just don't see uh, enough cool stuff from the game in the early hours. And like, to some people, the first like four hours of Dark Souls 1 is the undead bird. When like, that's supposed to be like an hour. But like some people, like they just take their time slogging through it. Like Over here by the they aren't good at the game. They're too new. They're too cautious and afraid because of the game's reputation. Even though they don't have to be, Dark Souls is not hard. Nitra. Um, and like almost everything I've seen of Deep Rock Galactic is the like generic cave shit. But, like, underwater jungle is cool. Oh, God. I'm standing in it. Thank you. Oh, he's just dumping something out of me. Like, we're still waiting on this in Minecraft, but this is cool. This is straight cool, man. Way past cool, even. Do you have a mule? Where is that damn tin can? Loot bug yeah, pop. Probably. Let's get it. Oh, why does it bleed? I don't like that. It's like she's bigger on the inside. <laughs> Please stop referencing Doctor Who. I assure you I won't miss it. Found some cropper. On the other hand, maybe I'm the problem here for just assuming that saying that something is bigger on the inside is a Doctor Who reference. It might not be. It most likely is. I can't stand a Doctor Who, personally. I even tried watching it. The original and the, like... I, I, wanna, I guess it's not the new season. That came out in, like, 06, guys. There's the ancient one and the old one. And like any good British television, it took forever for the next season to come out, so... Oh, and every season is like two episodes. So we're still on the new one because, like, we're not that far ahead from it. My friend Robert really oh. loved Doctor Who, but does not anymore. I approve of him for kicking the habit. One thing that always amazed me is that, like, for all the money, like, Doctor Who is the reason that Great Britain still has fucking police boxes and shit. And it's more famous than the goddamned Queen of England. More people probably know more facts about Doctor Who than they know the Queen of England's last name. 
I realize it's something of a narrow superlative to judge things on, but I digress. Ugh, never felt better. Very, very dwarvy to get health off of. <clears throat> Frog in my throat. Uh, to get health off of just a very friendly rock. Very bright in here. I don't need to use the flares as much. We've got a new miner inbound. Let's stand here and greet him. We are unbreakable. Rock and stone in the heart. So glad you're joining the team. <laughs> Hard gas, you say? Inhibitor field up. Getting off topic. I was just blown away by how Doctor Who, for all the fucking money it must make, I assume, still looks like absolute shit. Like, I can only assume that they just want it to look cheap. That's the only thing that I can say about Doctor Who. They just must want it to look cheap, because boy does it. Maybe it's a style thing. Oh, I love this grappling hook. Probably a lot behind this. Yep. Access provided. Red sugar will make you feel better. Oh, red sugar's the health pickup. One sentry gun ready to find the nitro for ammo. It's a very good feeling to just be digging in a thing with people. I found some more Kai. Just take your sweet time, old flesh, and call I've got all day. How much more cut is that? We're like halfway there. That's good. More than halfway. Also, I feel like Doctor Who cannot escape the fact that it's British television. Like, apparently, it's also one of the most, like, persistent and long-running audio dramas or radio shows or whatever. But, like... I can't think of any good Doctor Who comic books or video games or anything. And like, I know of people who would have told me about them if there were. Red sugar here, but watch it. It's highly addictive. It's highly addictive. That's a good piece of lore I didn't know. Anyway, thank you for tuning in to another installment of Things I Hate. Where is that you know what else I don't like? People who are field. like, man, I've got this show where I play roguelikes, and then they play procedurally generated games that aren't strictly roguelikes. This may be news to people who have never, uh, who haven't w followed the channel for a long time, but something that I put on this little trophy is the very first dislike any of my videos ever got was when I called Minecraft a roguelike. That was the first dislike I had ever, ever gotten. Zoom on a direct intercept course. Get ready. I feel like I have a much easier time seeing things 
when I've got the, the crew also throwing the lights down. And that's one thing that I think might be considered for single player. Because, like, obviously you have, um... Mining is hard work. Good thing we're dwarves. You have what's his name? Uh, Coop, uh Cooper B Bosco. Bosco. You have Bosco, and like Bosco might be better than. Jesus. Bosco might be better than any other like single character, and maybe even as good as like a team of characters with you. Oops, thank you. Drop pod departing in T minus five minutes. Rock. The wave is almost over. Wipe out what's left. Ready to kill some more crates. I might have mentioned this in the past, but this feels really good. Definitely shot a guy in the back there. Jesus. Alright, where this thing be? Oh yeah, I can follow these things. How useful. So I mentioned earlier that I much approve how the shotgun is like a shotgun that's maybe as good as current modern day shotguns. And most of the guns in here are. They don't claim to be more futuristic, but like, man, you usually do not have to like single shell by shell load modern military shotguns anymore. And like, so maybe it's dumb that you still have this sawed off shotgun in the future. Because it's very much a heck gun, but it specifically mentions in the item description that it's jury rigged. It's not supposed to be like this. The dwarf wanted it to be like this. And that I almost like better, because now it's a character thing instead of a gameplay thing. Big boy! Watch out! Jesus! What the hell just happened there? Okay, drop pods that away. Come on, really? Right on top of me? Just like that? On God? For real? Okay. <laughs> The mule has been successfully retrieved. Make it snappy, team. The drop pod won't hang around forever. Alright. I just want to make sure that I'm not going to get left behind again. Yeah. But I'll lay down some covering fire for them. Let there be light. light or loit? The difference is staggering, you'd find. Love a good grappling hook, no matter the game. Drop pod departing in T minus one minute. 
one. That doesn't sound... Okay, so we've got a guy looking at the thing. Okay, cool. So this is the way. Are we missing a guy? I think we're missing a guy. Take off. Alternatively, he might be already in the drop pod and have left us behind. Drop pod departing in 30 seconds. Platform up! No one jump off! Hold your fire, you brain lump of lawn! Dude, you put the thing a little too low. Ten seconds to take off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. Is that everyone? One, two, three. I'm four. We did it. Everyone got on. With not a lot of time to spare. James, you almost fucked us at the end there. <laughs> oh, that's great. It feels so good to, like, just hunker down with your bros, you know? Rock and stone. Management believes you're ready for a tougher challenge, and you have been cleared for salvage operations. Salvage. Disappoint them. Haven't done one of those yet. Let me see if I can't find. Mission selected. Powering That's up pretty the drop good. Pod. Get on board, team. Cap. Light fro. Nice. Ooh. Top knot. Cool. This affairs. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. So this is simple. Got some pads and some some belts. That's pretty. That's pretty tough and cool. I like that. All right. <laughs> the Swanson, the Watson, and the Bismarck. All fantastic. Initiating. Sorry, I'm shopping. Drop sequence initiating. Fasten your seat belts. Oh, I'm not even the only one on. Yeah, well, that makes me feel better. All right. A yeah. little cleaner there, you know? I don't really care about the sideburns that much, but only because I, uh, does that look better? Nah, it's all right. Vominos says Silas Bear. All right, Let's all right, go. on here. Right, where are we going? The previous crew lost their mini mules, their drop pod, and their lives in this cave. And their lives. To repair the lost mules, get the drop pod operational, and return to base. Expect heavy infestation. None of those are good to lose. I don't own a pickaxe. I should remedy that. I own a real, like, woodcutting axe, and I've cut wood with it. I own multiple machetes and a katana. 
because I am a nerd. All nerds own katanas. I think you get one, like, for free when you join. Let me just smooth this passageway out. Perfect. Now it's perfect. Alright, where are they at, though? They are... Okay, they're not far ahead of me. This is very fun. If the fact that this is making me play an online multiplayer shooter isn't telling you anything, then you probably don't watch me that much. Because, like... Every single fucking game I play has been a single player RPG or shooter. Occasionally a puzzle game. Have I done that visual novel yet? I don't think I've uploaded that. Um, and occasionally a horror game, but he had the same idea as me. You know what? Oh, we, he also had the same idea as me. Clear that out for you there, bud. I love that we were like, haha, yes, we'll sneak ahead because we're both scouts. And they were like, but no dwarf gets left behind, so. Steam Goiza. The, um, I think they're called chrysalids from Borderlands 2. Not getting anywhere on this one, huh? Ooh. You guys are glowy. That will teach you. Okay. Oh, we gotta put it back together. Uh oh. Enemy slow down. Okay, I love this thing. Maybe I would love it just a little more if it was a top loader. You know, the, the kind that's like an over-under shotgun? I love I love those double barrel shotguns. And of course, I love these as well. Because they're like the super shotgun from Doom. And that's always great. Oh god, it's a giant vagina. Like, not to be irreverent, but there is a phenomenon of designing monsters to look like... Uh, Volva. Specifically with teeth. I don't know why it's such a base scare thing, but it is. Okay. So I like that Attention, you minor inbound. they didn't even send us our own shit. They were just like, hey, these guys died down here, so, um... Find their shit, fix it, and then you can go home. You know, once you have the stuff that already failed to bring those guys home. Dibs on the side seat. I killed the loot bug, and I'm not so proud of it. Sorry, little bug. Your own fault for being full of goodies. Over here by the mark, boy. I mean, yeah, I, I can't say that much. Can you turn this down again because there's a lot more gunfire? Apologies if I've been quiet for the last couple of episodes. There's the mule. 
Molly was meant for hauling what I mined. All right, so yeah, I don't know how this works, to be perfectly frank with you. This is the draw pod, we're aware. Looks like somebody's found something down here. You're cute, but you're dead. New operational, well done. Oh, there are multiple mules. We're all, like, getting over here. Because that would make sense. Quick, shoot his soft underbelly. You can grab the last of it. I mean, I say this, but I don't have voice chat on. Oh, I'm out of here. A secondary objective has been achieved. Bonus will be transferred to your accounts on mission completion. Cool. Okay. So yeah, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here, having never done one of these missions before. Wondering if fighting bugs and moving dirt is the best way to make a living. <laughs> Certainly a very fun way. Oh, we fix it. Okay. We also need to combine it with its legs. Well done. You're repaired. Possibly. <laughs> All right, cool. All mules are secured. Now to get the pod working. First, establishing a proper connection between the pod and the space rig. Set up the uplink. You got it, Chief. Ooh, we're going to be here a while, huh? Thank you for the help. I love moments like this. Like in Team Fortress 2 where you just, it's just you and a guy, like two engineers just hammering away at shit, getting things done. It's great. Oh god. Oh god. Jesus, it's a nightmare in there. Nothing but jabronis. And then a few hunky huge ass dwarves. Oh, he got him with the pickaxe! Yo, what are you wearing? It looks so cool. There is over here. It's like those very rare and cool Zarya uh, skins. Because Zarya has almost no good skins. I mean, I don't know. I haven't played Overwatch in years now. Get him! Man, I'm, I'm just dead silent and focusing in hardcore on this. 
I almost have my Doom Fingers going, but like my character is not really fast enough to warrant Doom Fingers, you know? Thank you. Happily complete, there it is. Probably need this. Oh, it shows you your general stuff level? I don't know what that is. By dragging out the charge cable. <laughs> Nitro has been withdrawn and supply Very good. inbound. Shield charge. Fuel cells connected. That to hit me. Guard. Prepare the fuel cells for charge sequence. Yipers. Getting more ammo. Yeah, I just filled up so I can leave them to it. And it looks like the two little pegs I have there, or I, I have three out of four pegs, so I don't really need to grab more ammo, because it looks like I'm pretty. Fuel yeah. Stay close to keep them operational. We're expecting an increase in hostiles. Do we have an engineer? I don't think we do. Gunner. What a jaw-dropping experience! I think we've got another scout. And I'm a scout. What I'm doing here, this is not good. I'm getting separated. And like this pack dynamic hunting animal is explicitly using its its strengths against me. I'm gonna dig this out. Find a glitch. Cause there's space here that we could be standing on that we're not using. And like we could be retreating further into this wall space. Come and get me, you Let there be light. Shoot it. Fuel cells at seventy five percent. You're almost there. I'm doing my part. Oh, Jesus. Cool. This is a fun mission type. I love because like it's it's similar to the other one that we were in. Where it's like, hey, find that thing, and then figure it out from there. But it's different enough, because it's like, find your location, and figure it out. Because all of the objectives have been in this general zone. They've all been very close to this. Or practically on the way to this. These are very well designed missions, mission types. And they also really go well with the whole like Supply drop has been ordered is on the way. vibe of the procedural generation. Like it works real good. Grabbing ammo. 
All right, so I'm missing three pegs, so this should give me two. Okay, cool. Yeah, so it just literally does give you 50% of your ammo back, whatever that may be. He <laughs> squished one of them. Yeah. You know what? Alright, who do we got? We got three guys on. Where's the last dude? Did I screw this up by getting on too early? I might have. Suck on this, you freaking boy! OMG! Bunch of slow folks, ha! Out of grenade! Watch your fire! Retrieving. Is that the last one? Cold shoulder for ya! Lock and loaded! It is! It is! He ziplined on. That was really clever of him. <laughs> Um, these missions also go way quicker. Because I would get through like one or two when I was uh, playing with myself. But like with the team, I'm getting like, yeah, yo, yo, we had three scouts. <laughs> All right. Maybe it's time to switch classes. Maybe scout is just like this game is Ken, you know, maybe everyone just picks scout and I had no idea. Because I was like, Scout, that seems cool. I'll pick it and play it. And then ring a ding ding. Everyone plays Scout, so. Mm -hmm. New regions of Huxies have been made available to you. Keep this up, and you might just. Murder Boner just fucking carried us there for a little. Mission selected. Powering up the drop pod. Get on board, team. Because I want to see... What does this thing do? Pickaxe customization. Don't know how to unlock more of these, but let's go take a look. Bedazzled Raid. Are these also all randomly generated? Oh my god. <laughs> Don't tell management, but we overclocked your gun. Just the mod I need it. More capacity. Yeah. Ammo capacity. Useful. Expanded ammo bags or double. As well though spent. you had to ask, honey. And then who even knows? Flare gun. More ammo, thicker core, longer burn. That's useful. More time is fun time. Faster. Uh, I don't really need speed when I'm shooting my flare gun. Grappling hook, longer cable. Fine by me. And yeah, double down. Why not? IFG cryo or pheromone canister. So, what's that? I don't even know what that is. Improved generator, boosted converter. That's just plain useful. It. Been working my ass off to get this. <laughs> no change for that, because it's, it's what it is. Twan channel your dwarven rage through your pickaxe. While holding the mining button, press Rock fire to activate. 
Serrated edge. Nice. Shockwave and better weight balance. What is this? Right, pickaxe customizing. Drone modification. I don't even think I need to dilly with this. This is gonna be good. I have big plans for you, Bosco. Oh, I think that's the revive thing. Just what this drone needs. Hell yeah. Pog. Drop sequence initiating. Fasten your seatbelts. Oh, he kicked me out because I was fucking around too much. Ah, well. Yeah, this is... Kind of pushing the limits of what I can safely put into my roguelike show. But you know what? Fuck it. I'm having a very good time. Oh, that's cool. Paint job. How do I unlock more paint jobs? I like that. Good vibe. How about this? You know, I'll make it red for my wife. Forge, deep dives. Promote a character. Still don't know what promotion is. But I can taste how good it must be. I know it must be something cool. That's the trill? No wonder it fucking tears through Earth. Damn it, that thing's going up and I'm not. <laughs> Alright, let's see what else we got up here. Very steep there, I will say, on the old ladders. <laughs> that's cute. And I guess you'd only know that's up here if you'd been exploring properly. It's cute. I like it. Okay, Memorial Hall again. Federal Hall. Is that supposed to be dripping? Artificial gravity has been reestablished. Yeah, I guess we're high up enough Please above the... Kick the barrels into the launch bay. Barrels and launch thrusters do not mix. <laughs> uh <laughs> Ooh. Man. You are trespassing. Please turn around, get some work done. No, I will continue to explore. I like how it shines on my face. That's very fun. Woo! Very close there. Okay. Mineral trade. Assignment board. Where could that be? Dark Morkite. Oh, you, that's what they're, those are for. Do I get a leaf lover special? Oh, that's fun. Oh, it's got a real foamy head. Nice. I love that. I wish I could enjoy beer just for the thrill of having a fucking tankard of it and just. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Yeah, look at it go. Yeah. Throw it. Yeah. I just knew, you know? Somehow I just knew that he would do this. Also, I like how this is in the shape of a pickaxe, implying you slot your tool in here and some stuff happens to it. But, like, it probably isn't that big of a deal to play with a pickaxe like that. All right. I should probably get the friendly fire if I'm going to keep shooting people in the back. Okay. 
Let's. Damn, I'm good at this. Milestone completed. Nice. All right, I have had to pick people up a lot. I haven't been grabbed at all either. How come it is locked? Oh, I need three here. That makes sense. Okay, I'll grab this. I need another three. I'll get second win too. Titan senses two, and veteran depositor. All right. And I've used all my goodies. Damn. Because what I wanted was this. Or alternatively, this. Preserve. The oh, fuck. This likely is not a surprise to anyone who has uh, known or spake to my wife for very long, but her favorite Borderlands 2 character is, of course, Salvador. And boy, is this an in character game for her to play. Like, even the fastest, lightest character has this ginormous fuck-off shotgun and a, a rifle so thick and heavy that, like, you would probably break your arm firing it, you know? The kind of rifle that could make a space marine blush. Man, what a good fucking game. Like, hello? Like, I don't want to imply that people are sleeping on this game, because I don't really think they are. But, like, shit. I think more people should play this game. Not that people are sleeping on it, but there should definitely be more people playing it at all times. Forever. Um, I've been goofing around in this game for a whole month now, though. Oh, God. Oh, even more secrets. Surprises. Oh, they just deactivate that and you can just run around down there. Cool. I want to know how to change my color scheme if I can. And I want to get more cool stuff for my um, guns. And I might just come back and play more of this whenever I have an open slot in my schedule because, look, as though I'm going to need an excuse to play this fucking game, but... I'm Alfred. This has been Deep Rock Galactic. Uh, thank you all for coming. I will not play this again for Friday Night Roguelikes, but that does not mean I will not play it more in general. Because hot diggity, I fucking love this game already. Play of the Month. Robert Art Director. Forgot to bring ammo to a mission. Highest kill count anyway. Chosen from our Discord community. Oh, guy. That's so cool. Fuck, what a good game. But yeah, um... Thank you all for coming. Everyone should buy this game, and I'll see you guys next time. Uh, have a good day, everyone. Thank you.